हेलो एंड वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल कोर्सोलॉजी हब आई एम ज्योति झा एंड आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल तो गाइस आज हम लेके आए हैं आपके लिए नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन फॉर पर्सन विद स्पेशल नीड्स जो भी नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन है मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट हमारे स्पेशल के फील्ड में उनके हम डिटेल में जानकारी लेके आए हैं तो सबसे पहले मैं आपको बता दूँ कि ये दो मीडियम में आने वाली है वीडियो इंग्लिश में भी और हिंदी में भी तो जो भी इंटरेस्टेड है हिंदी में जानने के लिए ये ये वाला वीडियो उनके लिए वीडियो हम कल पोस्ट करने वाले हैं और आज वाली जो ये वीडियो है ये इंग्लिश में रहेगी सो जितने भी लोग इंग्लिश में देखना चाहते हैं वो इस वीडियो से जुड़े रहें और जितने भी लोग इस वाले वीडियो को हिंदी में देखना चाहते हैं वो कल इस वीडियो का इंतज़ार करें ठीक है और जितने भी लोग नए हैं वो प्लीज़ हमारे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर लें और बेल आइकन पे प्रेस ज़रूर करें ताकि हमारी हर वीडियो जो भी हम डालते हैं उसकी नोटिफिकेशन टाइम टू टाइम आपको मिलती रहे क्योंकि हम लाइव भी आते हैं तो लाइव कभी आपसे मिस ना हो इसलिए नोटिफिकेशन पे प्रेस करना नोटिफिकेशन बेल पे प्रेस करना बहुत ज़रूरी हो जाता है तभी आपके पास नोटिफिकेशन जाएगा कि हम लाइव आ चुके हैं तो उस पर प्रेस करना बिल्कुल ना भूलें ठीक है तो चलिए ज़्यादा देरी ना करते हुए शुरू करते हैं हमारे इस वीडियो के साथ जिसका नाम है जिसमें हम करने वाले हैं नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन फॉर पर्सन विद स्पेशल नीड्स तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शुड नो कि नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन क्या है वॉट इज़ नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन सो नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट्स आर इंगेज इन ह्यूमन रिसोर्स डेवलपमेंट इन द फील्ड ऑफ डिसेबिलिटी प्रोवाइडिंग रिहेबिलिटेशन सर्विसेज टू द पर्सन विद डिसेबिलिटीज एंड अंडरटेकिंग रिसर्च एंड डेवलपमेंट एफर्ट्स सो हाउ मेनी नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट वी विल बी गोइंग टू डिस्क्राइब यर लेट एस सी The first one is N I E P I D. Second is N I E P V D. The third one is is A I I S H. Fourth A Y G N I S H D. Fifth is N I L D. Sixth is N I E P M D. Seventh is S V N I R T A R S V Nirtar. Next is I P H, and then it is I S L R T C, and last but not the least N I M H R. So these are ten national institution. The most important national institution. will will be going to cover this okay so uh, what will be doing will be doing three today will be doing three national institution about them uh, kab wo established hue and all about their objective and all so today will be going to do three national institution the first one is nie pid nie pvd and ash a i i s h okay so let us see the first national institution n i e p i d the full form of this is national institute for the empowerment or persons with intellectual disabilities okay formally known as n i m h national institute for the mentally handicapped so before now it is n i e p i d national institute for the empowerment of person with intellectual disabilities but before it was n i m h now now uh, the name of this institute is changed into n i e p i d okay it is also iso 9001 2000 certification they have okay so let us uh, read about let us know about the n i p d about what is all about it N I E P I D established in the year nineteen eighty four at Mano Vikasnagar. Okay, Mano Vikasnagar. Sorry, Mano Vikasnagar. 
so it is it is established in the year of 1984 so here you can also take the screenshot and prepare the note accordingly okay uh, Mano Vikasnakar Sikandrabad is an autonomous body under the administrative control of Department of Empowerment of Person with Disabilities uh, Divyan, uh, Divyangjan, Ministry of Social Justice and Empowerment, Government of India, NIE, PID, formally NIMH, as I told you that formally it, it was uh, before it was NIMH is dedicated to provide quality services to person with intellectual disability in the na national national interest so it is uh, main focus is intellectual disabilities okay they provide services to the person with intellectual disabilities and it was established in the year of 1984 okay and it was in sikindrabad it is in sikindrabad right now okay now NIEPID formally NIMH has three regional centers. So it has three regional centers located at Noida, New Delhi, Kolkata and Mumbai. So Noida, New Delhi is same. Kolkata is second and third one is Mumbai. So they has uh, three original, uh, sorry, three regional centers. Okay. NIEPID formally NIMH model special education center located at noida new delhi okay the institute endeavors to excel in building capacities to empower person with intellectual disability divyangjan since the quality of life of every persons with intellectual disability is equal to other citizen in the country in that they live independently to the maximum extent Possible, so they make sure the person which is, which is uh, suffering from intellectual disability gets equal rights, e equal everything to the other citizen in the country. Okay. So National Institute for the Empowerment of Person with Intellectual Disability. So formally, as I told you before, formally it was in it was. National Institute for the Mentally Handicapped empowers the person with intellectual disabilities as we discussed earlier. It is uh, what is the main focus of, focus of this institute to empower the person with intellectual disability to access the state of the art rehabilitation inver, uh, inver, um, intervention sorry rehabilitation intervention educational therapeutic vocational employment leisure and social activities sports culture program and full participation okay so nipd is the main object of niepid is first one is human resource development research and development development of model of care and rehabilitation documentation and dissemination Consultancy services to voluntary organizations, community based rehabilitation, extension and outreach programs. So these are the objective of this institute. Okay. So we'll go to the another institute. We'll discuss. The second one is NIEPVD. The full form of this is National Institute for the Empowerment of Persons with visual disabilities formally known as NIVH NIEPVD previously formally known as NIVH the full form of that was National Institute for the Visually Handicapped now it is known as National Institute for the Empowerment of Persons with Visual Disabilities okay now, if we talk about NIEPVD, so the NIEPVD, NIEPVD has its headquarters at 116 Raj, Rajpur Road, Dehradun. Okay, the headquarter is in Dehradun with one regional center at Chennai, Tamil Nadu. Got the point? W what it is saying? Saying that NIEPVD is 
uh, located at Dehradun and one regional center at Chennai in Tamil Nadu and it is established in 1988. Again, I'll ask you all to take the screenshot of this slide and make the notes according to you. Okay, so it is established in 1988 and two regional chapters at Kolkata and Sikandrabad. Okay, Andhra Pradesh. Sikandrabad in Andhra Pradesh. Established in the year 1997. So, this NIPVD established in 1988, but their two regional chapter, which is in Kolkata and Sikandrabad, wa Sikandrabad was established in the year of 1997. The institute also coordinates and supervises composite regional center for persons with disabilities uh, surendra nagar hp established in the year 2001 okay now it owes its original to stephen Dun uh, dunstan's hostel for the war uh, war blinded established in 1943 so if we talk about how it is uh, was uh, it is established and what is the history behind this so it was mainly established for the war blinded in 1943 which offered a basic set of rehabilitation services to the soldiers uh, and sailors blinded in the world war second okay all those soldiers and sailors was got blinded in world war second they make sure to offer a basic set of rehabilitation services to them. In 1950, the government of India took over the St. Dunstan's Hostel and entrusted the Ministry of Education with the responsibility of developing comprehensive services for the rehabilitation of blind persons. Got the point? Now, so this cent a center was further upgraded as National Institute for the Visually Handicapped in the year 1979. And finally, in October 1982, it was registered under the Society's Registration Act 1860 and gained the status of an autonomous body. So if we talk about when it was established, so, it was established in 1943, okay, in World War II, okay, but it came under autonomous body in eight, uh, 1982, okay, in the year, uh, sorry, in, uh, sorry, handicapped in the year 1979 and finally in October 1982, October 1982, it was registered and gained the status of an autonomous body got the point now the third one is ish a double i s h the full form of this is all india institute of speech and hearing okay this institute was established in the year of 1966 i'm repeating again the institute was established in the year 1966 you can take the screenshot of this slide as well okay so, the All India Institute of Speech and Hearing, pop, uh, uh, popularly known as AISH, is a pioneer national organization advancing the causes of human resource development research, clinical care and public education on communication disorders. The institute was established in the year 1966 as an autonomous institute fully funded by the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, Government of India. So the major objectives of the institute are to impart professional training under clinical services, conduct research and educate the public on issues related to communication disorder, such as hearing impairment, mental retardation, voice, fluency and phonological and language disorder so it is the i mean it focus on the main objective of this institute is basically focus on 
communication disorder issues public uh, issues related to communication disorder such as hearing impairment mental retardation voice fluency and phonological and language disorder so the first objective is develop manpower in the field of speech and hearing and related areas throughout the country second one is conduct basic and applied research in the field of communication disorders third is offer clinical care on communication disorder and the fourth is provide public education on prevention of communication disorder so that's all it for today we have come with three national institute today tomorrow we'll come with another three national institute okay no sorry tomorrow will be there three national institute same videos there but wo hindi mein hogi theek hai same institute ko cover karke hum hindi walo ke liye video upload karenge and fir uske next day again we'll discuss about further three national institute got the point so hum acche se sare institute ke bare mein discussion kar paaye और जो भी कन्फ्यूजन या फिर डाउट है वो लोग वो सब आप कमेंट में लिख सकते हो यू कैन कमेंट डाउन बिलो एंड व्हाट विल डू जो भी कमेंट्स आएंगे डाउट्स में जो भी आपके क्वेश्चन रहेंगे हम कमेंट पर रिप्लाई नहीं करेंगे विल कम लाइव आफ्टर थ्री वीडियोस विल कम लाइव एंड देन डिस्कस ऑन दोज पॉइंट अगर कोई कन्फ्यूजन या डाउट रह गया है तो okay so thank you so much for watching our video here you can see the facebook uh, page also coursology hub if you will search on facebook at the red coursology hub you will find our facebook page go go that uh, on that page and please like that page as well so you never miss out any notification as well because hum wahan pe bahut hi important notification or information share karte hain so thank you so much we'll come again with another set of video thank you so much take care bye bye